sitting here thinking about it. I used to be gang banking, gun slinging. I remember like it was yesterday. Hold on, let me call you back. Let me call you back. Give me some motherfucking money real quick. Got my shit. Alright. Put your shit in the air, nigga. Put your fucking hands up. What do you think you're doing? I'll blow your fucking you brains out. What do you think I'm doing? Me all the bread you got in that motherfucker. Let me get it. Hurry up. Hurry up. Don't drop my bag on the floor neither. Oh, this nigga done, this nigga done dropped now the, the nigga, what? Uh, Fuck it. Uh, uh, bitch, we got uh, him. I can't even think about that shit no more. I was back then. A new person now. Trying to get my hoop on. Let me get my ass up though. Get my day started. What's on the radio, man? What's on the radio? What they talking about? Coming to you live from Miami TV. We have drafted the sorry ass nigga King. What the fuck were we thinking? What the fuck is going on? He's being able to see him for a few years, and so he understands. Ooh. That's true. I don't know what else to say after that. <laughs> Barnett! This leaves a cut it to 12 after trailing by 22. Johnson. Oh, my!
Right shot, Johnson. And it's Johnson with the jam. And, and that's the kind of lead pass we've come to Again expect for Jones. from him. Winslow comes in for Mario Chalmers. And King subbed in for Dennis Schroeder. King outside. side shoots over white and another basket for Miami did take the longest to develop it because the big man position the center and power forward were the toughest and that's kind of changed uh, Catton and B didn't take very long to develop big man coming to the league they're more polished now and, and I think the fact that the coaches are the coaching the skill sets now are so much more alike that guys can make it easier adjustment to the game because they've been playing their game and adjusted a lot longer than maybe the players before that had to find a different role once they enter into the role. Perfect. Wow. He's gonna put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to run. the Bulls. They'll be off to Boston for a meeting with the Celtics after this one. That'll be the second of this two-game road trip. Here's Dunn. Misses off the right iron. Uh, you can't be missing shots like that in the post. That'll get you a spot on the bench. Here's the lob to Adams. An emphatic L.U. jam. Absolutely the prettiest play Look in at the basketball. clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth. Levine against Butler. Outside Levine. Outside White. Just five to shoot. They get a hand on it. He's all alone. Pushing it up. Loats it up for Butler. Throws down the alley and slam. Butler always looking. That good for the game. I think it's, the refs should always be fair. I think, yes, uh, you're going to get the benefit of the doubt if you're a James Harden and you can cross everyone over and you get 10 free throws a game. He earns those most nights. Yeah, there's going to be some nights in which he gets a call or two here because as an offensive player, you want to be He's not going to give up effort. anything easy. And so Miami takes this one by a big margin. This game may not have been the most exciting we've ever seen, but you have to appreciate just what a clinical performance they put on. I know their fans appreciated it, and we saw at times just stretches of excellent defense, potency from an offensive standpoint as well. They, they were pretty much.